we've been working with West Midlands Combined Authority and especially the Energy and Bioproducts Research Institute, which is EBRI at Aston University, in evolving and developing our enhanced and advanced pyrolysis system. Pyrolysis is, is very simple. It's actually taking a material, putting it into an enclosed space where there's no oxygen, and then heating it so that the actual material breaks down, thermally degrades, and releases all the solid, liquid, uh, and gaseous uh, items from that, that material itself, but without combustion. That's the important point. There is no combustion uh, carried out in the process. The sorts of deployments that we're looking at are where we have maybe a, a company which requires heat to put into its industrial process. It produces some waste. We can take that waste, we can remove the cost of that waste from the company. We can use the, the products of the process, the heat, to feed back into its industrial equipment. And at the same time, we can produce the biochar. So you have replacements of fossil fuels and also increasing growth potential of plants and locking carbon in. Within the uh, Innovation Accelerator, uh, partnerships with companies are phenomenally important because we need that to work with those companies to realise the, the designs, the technology that we've produced and bring it out into the marketplace. If we can't get a value associated with that technology, if we can't give it a market value, it won't scale. Uh, it's really important that we're able to scale so we can get the employment benefits, we can get the economic benefits for the region and also the environmental benefits. We've uh, evolved over time generally in our uh, design and manufacturing capabilities, working with the West Midlands supply chain. Uh, there's a great deal of manufacturing capabilities within the West Midlands and we utilise that to a great degree. So we started off uh, manufacturing one kilowatt wind turbines, moved on to 10 kilowatt turbines and control systems and we then moved on to tyre pyrolysis, uh, designing the, the whole plant, operating that plant on behalf of the client, and then moving on to organic pyrolysis systems in association with Aston University. The products that come from the processing are wide. We get a solid, which is the actual biochar, but we also get a liquid and gases, which can be used to actually generate energy. Going back to the char, uh, we can put it into the ground as a soil amendment process, so we can actually change the actual structure of the soils, increase the actual foundations within buildings. We, we sequester carbon at the same time by doing so. Ultimately, we, we, we'll need people from the West Midlands to join us as we grow. We will play quite a, a role in in training these people, especially in the in green sectors. It's been a fantastic opportunity working with West Midlands Combined Authority and also the Accelerator Project, which is enabling us to bring this technology out and the benefits of this technology out for the region. We are a climate change process. We are trying to reduce the actual climate change effects on, on the world and biochar is one of the methods of doing it.